in today's video guys i'm going to show you how to fix lag in fortnite chapter 4 season 2 if this video was helpful please consider to subscribe to the channel this would really help me out a lot guys i produce daily content and now let's get to this topic and in today's video guys in the first place i prepared for you a brand new laptop pack 2023 which is going to contain basically everything which we're going to use in today's video guys chris titus tech utility and also a game user settings file with a stretch resolution already applied for you guys so you just simply have to drag it into the right folder and enjoy having the best settings possible in the game what i want to do now in the first place is head over to my website guys Lestrade's Blogspot and under FPS Boost you can then find a post with exactly the same name and the same thumbnail as the video you're watching right now and once you get the laptop pack on your PC we're gonna first of all take a look at Chris Titus Tech Utility. You're gonna open this up and copy the following code from here. Once we're in there we're now gonna go into a Windows search bar and just simply type in that PowerShell until we can find the Windows PowerShell right click onto it and run it as an administrator. Once the PowerShell itself is opened up guys you're going to paste the following code in there and press enter and huge shout out to Chris Titus for actually creating this amazing tool you can basically see you can get a whole bunch of tools but what we want to focus on about is tweaks actually because once we're in here now guys you can see we have recommended selection where we can enable desktop laptop minimal or clear so therefore what you of course want to do right now if you're on a laptop is select laptop here on the top bar itself and you can already see everything which is somehow important for lab is now going to get automatically checked essential tweaks basically of course in the first place creating a restore point this is super important because if anything should get messed up guys you can always go back to the restore point super easy so therefore don't worry and then we have something like disable the telemetry if you even hover over it we can see description disable microsoft telemetry microsoft spies heavily on you when using the edge browser also stuff like that basically allowing microsoft not to track most of the data on your pc then we have something like disable active history then we have something like disable location tracking you can see basically all of the most useless services which you don't need on your pc to run 24 7 in the background especially game dbr guys so therefore just simply leave the essential ones here on and then all you guys gotta do is basically run tweaks on the bottom once you're done with that you can close it and restart your pc and then we're gonna continue with the next step and once you restarted your pc you can then open up the laptop game user settings plus resolution file and drag your game user settings onto your desktop then all you guys gotta do is go into windows search bar type in that presenter temp presenter open it up click under local on the top press f on your keyboard for fortnite game saved config windows client and in there you're gonna delete your current game user settings and replace them with the brand new ones from the pack itself once we're going to open them up guys you can also see that i've changed everything entirely to get the most amount of fps on your laptop right now and i also applied a resolution which is 1024 times 768 which is really the sweet spot for laptops guys because this res still looks kind of decent you know it's still definitely playable and it's going to give you a nice fps boost of around 30 to 40 percent depending on how strong your device is so therefore all you then need to do is right click onto your game user settings Go in the properties and make sure to check the entry boot read only so you don't accidentally change your settings in game if this video was helpful guys please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and also don't forget to join the discord we're almost a hundred thousand active members so therefore if you need any more help always feel free to ask over there and don't forget to check out the two videos which are right now on screen